Hello everyone, my name is Kobe, and today I'm going to give you a tutorial on how to deal with one-on-one -on -one situations. First of all, I want to thank you all for the great support on the last videos, it really helps me a lot. But let's not waste any more time, let's start with the video. So the first thing I want to talk to you about is the importance of reading the play, because this way the opponent won't get the opportunity to run freely at goal. As you can see, in these clips, the opponent is trying to play a ball right through the defense. I read the play and just sprint out using triangle. This way, I put the attacker under pressure and make the save. You can always pause the video to try and read it yourself. Also, when the player wants to play a low cross, you can hold in triangle and the keeper will just go for the ball, preventing the ball to be in a very dangerous area. Now, when a player is running straight at goal, I wait for the player to come inside the box. I then hold triangle to go sprinting for the ball. In the next situation, you can see the player going in for the pass, and as soon as I see the pass being played, I sprint out of the goal. The moment I see the player hit the ball, I press circle or square, as in my opinion, they give the same outcome. Try to only press it once and not hold the button for too long. Now, the difference with the next clip is that the player is a lot farther away from the goalkeeper. In these cases, try and use the right analog stick to dive to the far corner. It's difficult to master these scenarios, but if done correctly, you'll have a very high chance to save the shots. Thank you all for watching. If you have any more questions, be sure to let me know. Feel free to subscribe for more tutorials. See you next time and stay safe.